Hi, welcome back to Tasker Tutorials, User Created Variables Part 2. I am sure by now, that you've figured that variables are a most important part in Tasker. There are lots of variables that are included, but there is a few variables that I wish were among them. For example, power connection variables and display states. Luckily, it is easy to fix this by creating your own variables that function just like the one that came with Tasker. In part 1, I showed you how to add display state variables and whether you are on a call or not variables, you will find the link to that video in the description area. And today we will continue where we stopped in part 1, I am going to add variables for power connection types and Wi-Fi connection. Open Tasker and go to the project that we named my variables. Click the plus sign. Give this profile a name, Power AC. Click OK. Click on State. Click on Power. Click on Power again. From the Source drop down menu, Select AC. Click the back arrow. Select New Task. Give this task a name, Power AC. Click OK. Click the plus sign. Click on Variables. Then on Variable Set. Type in the variable name, I called mine, power, be sure to capitalize at least one letter. Set it to AC. Click the back arrow twice. Click the plus sign. Give this second profile a name, Power USB. Click OK. Click on State. Click on Power. Click on Power again. This time, select USB from the Source drop down menu. Click the back arrow. Select New Task. Give this task a name, Power USB. Click OK. Click the plus sign. Click on Variables. Then on Variable Set. Type in or select the variable Power. Set it to USB. Click the back arrow twice. Notice that this profile color is green, because my phone is connected to a USB cord, the variable is already working. Same thing with display profile, I can use these variables in an if statement anywhere in Tasker. Let's continue, click the plus sign to create a third power profile. Let's call this one, no power. Click OK. Click on state. Click on power. Click on power again. Leave the source on any. But, if you want to add more profiles, for wireless charging, as an example, then follow the way we did it in Profiles 1 and 2. And check the invert box. And this means, the device is not connected to any power source. Click the back arrow. Select New Task. Give this task a name, 
no power. Click OK. Click the plus sign. Click on variables. Then on variable set. Type in or select the variable power. Set the value to none, you can always use zero. Either one will work as long as you remember what the value is when you use it later on. I am using the value none, when not connected to power source. Click the back arrow twice. OK, we've just created three awesome power connection variables, now, let's go ahead and make a Wi-Fi network connection variables. Click the plus sign. Give this profile a name, my Wi-Fi. Click OK. Click on state, then select net, and then Wi-Fi connected. In the SSID field select your networks by clicking the search icon and choosing your networks. You can select as many networks as you have, and do not forget to add your work networks. You can leave the rest of the fields as they are. Click the back arrow. Select new task. Call it my Wi-Fi. Click OK. Click the plus sign. Click on variables. Then on variable set. Type in the variable name you want to create, I called mine, my Wi-Fi. Set the value to on. Click the back arrow twice. Press and hold on the task. Click on Add Exit Task. Select New Task. Give it a name, call it, No Wi-Fi. Click OK. Click the plus sign. Click on Variables. Then on Variable Set. Type in or select the variable, My Wi-Fi. Set the value to off. Click the back arrow twice. So whenever you are connected to your own Wi-Fi, it will set the variable, my Wi-Fi to on, and you can use this variable in a profile or a task, to disable lock screen, raise volumes or whatever you want it to do when you are at home. So let me use one of those variables in an old profile just to show you how it works. I have a profile that turns Wi-Fi on, and disable lock screen when I am at home. I am going to add an if statement to turn Bluetooth and sync on when power cord is connected. As you can see, it is very simple to tweak a task to do multiple actions when certain conditions are met, and you do not need to add a new profile every time. In part 3, I will add car and desktop docs and I will show you more examples how to apply it to profiles and tasks. So please subscribe to my channel and stay tuned for more task tutorials, and by any means, let me know if you have a question or a suggestion and I will be happy to address them.